Welcome to Tinkernut.com's videocast. If you like these videos, please support them by subscribing or commenting below. In this video, I'm going to you can archive and preserve web pages, kind of like archive.org's Wayback Machine. And to do this, you don't need to install anything. You just need to sign up for a free account um, at this web page, Itiracy. If you do a Google search for it, it should take you to their home page, or else you can just go to itiracy.com. And then just click the big orangish yellow sign up button and sign up for an account. Um, it'll ask you for your email address and you'll need to create a username and password. And then it's going to send you a confirmation email. And once you click that confirmation email, it takes you to this page. And what you need to do here is just hit Control B to bring up your bookmarks and drag the two little bookmarklets that it gives you over to your bookmark toolbar. And now if you want to archive a web page, just go to that web page. Let's say I want to archive my own web page. I'll just go to it and click the archive to itiracy bookmark and it's going to bring up this page. And now I can organize it by putting it in different folders and also adding tags to it to make it uh, easier to search if I, if I start archiving a whole bunch of web pages. And then once you click OK, give it a couple minutes and then click the Go to My Pages link and it's going to bring up the pages that you've archived. And if you click on it, it'll take you to the Itiracy Viewer where you can view the entire web page. So no matter what changes you make to it in the future, you've archived it on this website. Alright, that's it for this tutorial. For more, go to Tinkernut.com.